Here's something that I got today which really takes me back to my childhood. This is a compact uh, portable computer. And I think this probably is from around 1985 or so. And this was this model of computer was the first one that I ever uh, really used. My dad had one of these and he would bring it home from work. It's got composite video output and I think that's a CGA output there and uh, I think that's a serial card back there and that's a parallel port. And I use that composite video to make a video karaoke system. I would put, uh, I wrote basic programs and would put things into the program to occupy the processor for a, a, the appropriate amount of time so that the words would print on the screen with the music properly. Then I remember trying it on a faster PC and it just blew right by because the processor ran faster. Here's the keyboard. It's kind of different than the modern keyboard. The F keys are all over here. And there's no separate number pad on it. The one I had when I was a kid is still at my parents' house, but uh, you know how, how I would get it. It quit working in the keyboard, and I tore the keyboard apart, and I don't know that the keyboard will ever go back together, but I think I still have parts of it there. Here's the power cord. Made in USA, model 101-709. And the fan is up in here. You can store the power cord up in there. This has, I think, a 10 megabyte hard drive on it. The one I had when I was a kid originally had two floppy drives, but then my dad got a, a 10 megabyte hard drive put in it. So I'll go ahead and power it up, and it really makes a distinctive sound when you power it up. It, it, it really uh, brings back memories hearing it start up. Okay, so I've got the C prompt now. We'll do DIR. I'm so used to LS for uh, Linux, so we'll do DIR. Let's do DIR slash P. We've got a DOS directory, we've got a write directory, and a movie directory. Let's let's go to the DOS directory. I wonder what stupid.bat is. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Let's see, let's do CD DOS. I guess these are just all the DOS programs. I think this has got basic uh, or basic A. Demo one dot BAS. Let's try basic. -a. That's what I would always call it. I don't, I don't know if it's really basic A or basic, -a, but that's what I'd always call it when I was a kid. And I think later we ended up getting GW Basic for this. So I'm really uh, looking forward to using this. 
and the keyboard does all seem to work correctly on it. 